We have a gigantic update for you guys. The sexy, sexy 20 foot containers. <laughs> it doesn't look smooth. It doesn't look smooth at all. Ah. Good morning, guys. So this vlog is gonna be much different than the ones that you used to see in our channel because this is gonna be more like raw travel vlog because one of our subscribers actually suggested us to maybe consider expanding the container idea to the other Philippines islands and that is what this vlog is gonna be about. Not really, but mainly I'm just traveling with one of our best friends, Jericho. We are traveling to, we're traveling to Butuan and from Butuan we are traveling to Kamigin Island. We've been to Kamigin before and it also kind of stuck in our hearts and we really want to see if there is any potential there. So this vlog is gonna be raw travel vlog and how to get to Kamigin, so let's go. Yeah. Linda will be very happy about this hat. <laughs> she will love it. <laughs> All right, so right now we are in Surigao city. This is the, like the starting point of our travel and we are just looking for the, for the bus to Butuan city. Take no, the, if it's the same, let's just take this. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. It doesn't matter. So hours, um, three hours, or four hours, and you have bus. And you don't have time back. How much he was offering? The same. 240? Same with this, but you have to squeeze. Ah, yeah, I was thinking that. Ah. Um, you have big legs. Long legs. Ah, and that's uh, the bus leaving to Butuan, right on time. So we just arrived in Butuan, and it took us a little bit longer than we thought at first. At first we thought it will take around two hours or something, but it actually took us uh, three and a half. And right now it's almost midday, afternoon. And we really hope that the last, because the last ferry going to Kamigin is at 4.15 p.m. And we still have like four hours to go. Yeah, we'll see if we make it. So guys, if you are wondering where is Linda, she's back at the construction site because there sh uh, is a need that always there should be someone there who just overlooks what's happening. But right now, before we jump into the next bus, we are grabbing a quick lunch. But while we are eating, uh, let, let's Linda will show you how the construction site looks. Hi there, guys. So while Chris and Jericho is eating lunch, I just wanted to give you a little update uh, from the container vans. Look at my sunburn. Yeah, it's been sunny lately, so don't mind my face that much. Uh, we have done a couple of important things. First of the things is that we actually moved in. So as of last Saturday, we live here. And let me enter through the window. This is how it looks. Well, this is the unfinished part, like the unfinished container one. The other one that we live in is completely finished. Uh, we have a refrigerator here. We have a beautiful thick box curtain and then the bed on my behind me which one you can see right now it's so weird to film from the phone because i don't know it doesn't make sense for me and then aircon a beautiful beautiful aircon and of course the finished bathroom with a varnished sink made out of cement and then the coco lumber wooden plate to hold the sink and we have the hot water over here and a heater and we have put around some plants and flowers which is actually what we've been doing the most for the past week is we have been putting landscaping uh so planting some carbo grass and planting some flowers as well as making as much furniture as we can one of the examples of the furniture is 
Hey, by the way, look how beautiful it looks. We have varnished, actually polyurethaneed the terrace. Uh, put some plants around on the sides over here. Uh, some lights and then the nipper roof. And look really from far away. If you don't look at my face, it looks absolutely beautiful and I'm in love with our container house. You can see there our workers are busy. And another thing that we have uh, right here is a really nice, <laughs> it's a really nice, how do you call it? Let's say a hanger slash closet that has been made out of bamboo. Look how beautiful it is and how well done it is. I'm so, so extremely proud of the work that the guys are doing here. And then they're making another stop a bit over there out of bamboo. And as well, it's James' birthday today. Happy birthday, James. The least cuddly dog in the world. Happy birthday, James. Happy birthday. You really don't like to cuddle, do you? Mosquitoes are biting him. Poor James. James is two years old today. So everybody wish a happy birthday to James in the comments. There we have some more plants in the back. And also a finished fence. Hi, Bumblebee. A uh, finished fence for the three quarters of the property. And we have planted some plants along there as well. And then some orchids, or at least that's what they told me because I have no idea what plants are what. And then some other plants right here. And this is where the party happened last Saturday when we were grilling and making a lechon to celebrate or moving in. That's it for me guys. I'll get you back to Chris and Jericho's adventure on their way to come again, exploring the beautiful island once again. I'll see you next time. Love you. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. So we are back. So apparently we were at the wrong terminal and we had to take a multicab to another terminal in Butuan where there is a minivan going to Cagayan. But we are not going to Cagayan, we are going to Bali, Baliong. Balinguan. Uh, from where we are taking the ferry to come again. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. <laughs> 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 video. Okay, okay. Can you tell subscribe to travel it? <laughs> Subscribe on YouTube? Yeah, we have YouTube. Yeah. So unfortunately we had to come back to the previous terminal because uh, the mini one drivers they were trying to charge us 2,000 for two of us or 1,000 per person just to go for two hours in a minivan but yeah so that's why we had to come back to this terminal and now we're looking for a non-stop bus that goes to Boeing 1. So it looks like we're gonna miss our ferry because we still need to go for like 20 more minutes and the ferry is leaving after 4 minutes so we're gonna miss it so probably we'll have to take the ferry the most next ferry is at 4 a.m. Just need to find a place where to stay in the port. Yeah. At least it. Haha, guys, we made it. The boat was late for like 20 minutes and we made it right on time. We got so lucky. And yeah, the ticket office was closed. So we are just buying the tickets here on the boat. I will see. But we made it. Nice.
hours later, we finally arrived in Kamigin. It was a very long trip, very tiring. Yeah, but finally we're here. And we are meeting Jericho's friend. Uh, Jericho, who are we meeting? Uh, uh, Jericho, who are oh. we meeting? We're meeting my very close friend from Iligan. She's super hyper and active. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy her. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She will be the one showing us around and just yeah, kind of showing the all the good parts of coming in. Although we've been here like six months ago, but yeah, maybe there is so much more that we haven't seen yet. Good morning, guys. So it's the next day. So yesterday was very dark, very late when we arrived. It was almost eight o'clock. So we just found uh, Echo's friend's house where we stayed the night. And yeah, this morning, the first task was to find a bike so that we can get around the island. Otherwise, it's it's very complicated to use the public transportation all the time and you cannot access all the locations with it. So yeah, we just get a bike. And by the way, the property right where I'm right now, this is the first location that we are checking out. This is location by the beach. And yeah, guys, we are looking for another property around the Philippines and if you think that this would be a great idea to have more container houses around the Philippines just let us know in the comments I hope that you enjoyed this so not so typical like construction vlog yeah Linda explained you a little bit and updated you what's going on on the construction site but the next video will be more focused on the updates about the, the container vans in Shargao but guys if you enjoyed this video let us know in the comments like the video make sure that you subscribe and see you in the next video